Philosophy of Wicca by Amber Lane Fisher. I know it's really odd to see a few <laughs> Wicca books in my channel, like, video list, but, like, I want, like, for this channel, I want, like, a variety of different books for people to have a look at, so, like, if you know my faith, like, I'm not, like, yeah, at the beginning I was w Wiccan, but now I'm not, so it's just a little odd <laughs> for me to actually sit down and, like, look through a Wicca book, but... This one, not too, like, it's not, like, the tip, not a beginner 101 book. So, you got 12 chapters, a resource section after. It's just over page. There's, like, a few sites to look at. So, it's not really, to me, not really a resource page. It's just, like, seven websites. <laughs> And a little bit of a description about it. So, it could be a starting resource page. So, there's that. And I wrote down a quote from, from the book. So, the book is um, to examine other religions, philosophies, and ideas and compare them to the Wiccan faith and to gain a better understanding of the theology of Wicca. So it's for those who want a little more understanding and like more have um, more than to have like a few ritual spells or basic info kind of book. This is a, this is more of the theology, philosophy kind of poor like side of the Wiccan religion. So. If you are looking for like a beginner 101 type book, this isn't going to be one for you, like in a way you would already have established your foundation and you wanting to go a little more beyond the understanding of me, of you doing like rituals or celebrating a Sabbath or whatever. So this book could become a in, a in use for you if you are the type of person who wants to get that theological philosophical side of your religion. So it's inform like it is inform inform informative but not totally formal. It is you got personal pronouns used, so you aren't you so you are you will be seeing the like I we kind of thing instead of like the you, you, third person pronouns. So, you got like a chapter faith focusing on the divine, so going into the god goddess and other deity with like the god and goddess in mind. So, it is going on the fact of like it being about the Wicca religion and the god and goddess aspect and it goes into looking at God like the Christian God a chapter on the goddess nature so someone goes through like an introduction to the Sabbaths and it has a guided meditation as well a chapter on balance descending into the depths so the underworld so you do have a chapter on that and Chapter 7, The Wiccan, Wiccan Read and Magician's Manifesto, An Explanation of the Soul, Sexuality, Sacred Sex, and Gender Roles. So, that's being talked about. <laughs> so again, it's not your basic introduction book. These topics are being discussed in this book. Magic and Witchcraft, Wicca and Mainstream Religion, Bridging the Divide, Living Theology, Turning Belief into Practice, and it's just over 250 pages. So, if you want to get a little bit more out of your Wicked Faith, again, not for me, 
but it is there for those who want it. And yeah, happy readings.